goodbye, Fire Tribe, and happy holidays if you're seeing this during the December holidays. This is Therese Firewoman with hashtag good vibe in five, sharing ideas and insights for allowing a good vibe, shifting your vibe, and living life on fire in five minutes or less. For more about what we do and why we do it, visit our About Good Vibe in Five video. But for now, my friends, I'm actually using the green screen today because we just did a little photo shoot and getting ready to create the next course. It's called Onward, Upward, and Forward, and I'm so excited because it's time for a change. It is time to move forward. It is time to start living life again. And even though COVID is still happening and all that kind of stuff, and it may be a little while before everyone has the vaccine and it works itself out, I believe that with the right mindset and with making the right choices, we can still live life to the fullest. We can still allow who we are. So anyway, enough about that. Let's get to it and do it and take our three slow deep breaths. Let's breathe in right here. And exhale. Another slow deep breath in. And exhale. Let your neck, shoulders, muscles relax. All loving that natural soundtrack. A little thunder happening in the background here. And one more slow deep breath in. And exhale. so good all right my friends and join me in this intention if you like thank you for helping me easily and naturally recognize and focus upon the good that is and to focus onward upward and forward yes to the good that is always becoming and i like to add in truth the good that i and you and we have already created together and thank you for helping me share the ideal message and ideal word, short and sweet, to benefit the greatest number of people today. So I think my message today really is about onward, upward, and forward, friends. It is a choice that we can make in any given moment. It really, really is. You know, there are, first of all, I got to tell you, there are some intense moments that I have had in my life, especially in the recent past, that while I'm in the middle of it, it's like, how the hell can I possibly choose onward, upward, and forward from here? You know, I feel what I feel. I do what I need to do in that, in that particular moment. But I let that moment inspire and inform me of the next choice that I can make. In that moment of feeling sadness or anger or frustration or overwhelmment or whatever that is, I can allow myself, and I absolutely have, and honestly, I have found for me that re repressing any of those negative emotions is actually just about a guarantee to keep them around as long as physically possible. So I have discovered allowing myself 100% to feel what I feel to go ahead and do what I need to do. But as I am feeling those feelings, knowing very much what I don't want, to immediately start saying, you know what I do want? I know it would be better. And in that moment, even though I haven't changed my emotional state that dramatically, maybe just a little tiny, tiny, tiny hair, in that moment, friends, I have already started walking the path of what I want. And so can you. It's just a matter of being conscious and making a conscious, deliberate choice. And friends, please do not expect perfection from yourself. Do not expect instantaneous change. It is incremental change. It is those choices that move you onward, upward, and forward in this second, in this moment. And the continuation of that process that brings you from where you are to where you want to be. Oh boy, do I have a lot more to say about that, and I will in the course that I release next month. But anyway, friends, here's to a day filled with beautiful bonuses, awesome upgrades, and sensational happy surprises, to choosing to focus onward, upward, and forward, and to living life on fire. Good.